<coughs> you know, you guys, what's indicative of a society in decline uh, is how it treats its children and its elderly. And we have failed as a society on both counts. So I don't know if y'all remember, uh, you know, those new, those little babies that was found last year, battered uh, newborn, what do they call them, Zane and Zeke? Well, uh, uh, they were found in the alley like a year ago. You guys remember what? It, well, um, I, I thought this was kind of um, heartfelt. The New York. Uh, police department um, gave them, um, you know, a, a held a, ver a visual for them, and they have a ten thousand dollar reward, of course. Um, uh, and it was held in the Bronx. Uh, it was for a pair of twin boys who were found battered and dead a year ago. The boys Zeke and Zane, named by the police department, were found in the alley off College Avenue in Claremont on November 9th, 2020. The NYPD offered a $10,000 reward for anyone with more information on the identity of the killer or the mother of these boys. So far, no arrests have been made and the investigation is still remains ongoing. Um, so they had the whole department out there and um, uh, it's just that the things that we do to one another and when someone hurts innocent babies, newborns, I just don't know what to say. That there's a society again that is in such decline. Um, then there's nothing you can put into words. The babies, uh, I mean, the building superintendent had found the bodies, which he initially thought were baby dolls. The unconscious babies were seen wearing diapers and wrapped in a brown paper. In, oh, God. Uh, the boys were taken to the Bronx Lebanon Hospital where they were pronounced dead. Previous reports claimed that the boys had died after being strangled by their umbilical cords or after falling from the building. But those uh, things have been disputed. How can we do life like this? It's, uh, Lieutenant William O'Toole said it appeared they had been hit or suffered from purposeful blunt forced trauma. Officers questioned neighboring residents about the fatal attack, including taking DNA samples. They even checked the hospital records in the state as well as New, Jer and, and New Jersey to see if the mother may have sought medical attention after giving birth but still had no luck. Everyone in the building cooperated. You always get a tip. You always get a family member, a relative, a stranger who says, hey, we've got, you know, we know what's going on. We've had calls like that. This girl was pregnant. But we got there and we find her baby. Yeah, it is strange that a year later and no one and nothing has come forward about the situation. The officers had named the boys again, Zeke and Zane, after they found them. One means God's gracious gift, and the other means God's strength. I think that's more for them. So they will they keep that in their heads, and they keep going forward. So they'll keep that in their head as they keep going forward. Anytime we get a call, we go out, and I just love to get a call. The funeral was held for the twins at Eternity Funeral Service in September. They were placed together in a single white casket adorned with flowers, balloons, bowls, and teddy bears. Both officers and local residents paid their respects to the young victims. That's the saddest thing. They found him in the alley.
What y'all know? I, I want to hear y'all take on this story. You know, do y'all think that we getting more insane as the day goes on? And what about what I said about it's indicative of how we treat our elderly, um, which I'm one of them, and how we treat our children? Do you think that that is a clear indication of which direction a society is going in? Mad Hatter, answer me. Somebody out there tell me what they think about this. You know, and before I sign off, uh, 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 let me say this. I want to um, say, love your family, love your babies, love your um, uh, offspring. Let them know that you care about them. Don't leave any stone unturned where somebody in your family could be responsible for doing something so hideous. It's disgusting. All right, if you like what you hear, please like, subscribe, and share, and please leave your opinion below. I'm so curious as to what y'all think about this Zeke and Zane who was left out in a damn alley like dogs. Like, matter of fact, dogs are treated better. I'll see y'all in the next one.